It's so nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Okay, so there's a lot of um, gaggle of girls, a lot of giggling, a lot of fun energy. Was it like that on set as well? It, yes. <laughs> it was like one giant slumber party and I was so like beyond happy to be a part of it. Like. These girls are amazing, and they're, you know, they yeah. giggle and they selfie, but they're like strong, empowered girls, you know, and they know they're who they wise. are. Some they're of their wise. We're so deep. I was like, okay. And they wow. believe in themselves. Like, I don't, I, I wish that I'd been like that at 12 or 13, you know, like that sort of self confidence that just glows from you. I would love to hear from you because I interview a lot of kid actors, and sometimes you interview and they're like very much like a kid actor. Everyone was so genuine. Like, they didn't seem like they're trained yet. Is that something you were looking for? with casting this movie? 100%. We spent all of our pre-production time in casting. It was something that I insisted on because, you know, my background is in casting. Oh, really? Yes. Um, I did a lot of internships in casting before I started directing, and I spent... I, in film school way back in the day. Where did you go to film school? USC. Okay. Yeah, grad very school. Very prestigious for people Thank that don't you. know. <laughs> That's very cool. So yeah. you kind of use that as a stepping stone to get to do what you really want to do. Which oh, is yeah. Great. And everyone, you know, you have to sort of trade favors when you're in school, like crew and do grip work, which is my least favorite thing to do. <laughs> so I cast everyone's films, you know, that was my thing. I and that. And I love working with kids, which I know a lot of directors don't, but I actually sometimes prefer it to working with adults. I think that there's a lot more fun to be had because acting at its core is just playing make-believe mm -hmm. professionally and like who's better at playing make-believe than children, you know? I love that. I have to ask you, I felt like I was a little older than the main crowd here, so I didn't know if they were going to get my references to 90s movies, but you might get I got like an idea. One of the sweet girls, she was like, I had a makeover scene. I'm like thinking clueless. Were there any like homages to like any old movies from back in the day that you wanted to like get inspiration from at all? There's a little bit of like a vibe of the like mean girls, clueless, yeah. you know, but for the middle grade audience, you know, yeah. and, and definitely trying to stay true to the heart and like um, authenticity of the book, you know? Authenticity was a big thing. Like you said, these kids seem so genuine. Yeah. And when I was looking for the cast, I was very like, I don't want these over the top performances. I want genuine kids. I want kids that are relatable and real to be on screen. And, you know. And well, the reason I said that is to me, the 90s was clueless and then the 2000s was Mean Girls. So I'm like, maybe this is the new generation's version of that, you know? There's, that's what we're hoping for. <laughs> so very last question, I'll let you go, because everyone's going in. This is about an it list. Yes. So is there anything as a director or just in your personal okay. life on your bucket list that you still want to accomplish? Oh, my God. There's like, like a couple fun, quick Eight ones. billion <laughs> things, you know. I want to... I want to direct Pippi Longstocking. <laughs> I want to remake That'd be that so movie. cool. I know. I ha like you know, Pippi's How the did strongest. Out into the universe. She's the strongest girl in the world. I love Pippi. She's the str she can carry a horse. You know. She's so cool. Yeah. So that's definitely a life goal. I've got a bunch of features that I'm really excited about making. But I'd say that my ultimate it list, you know, number one is just to like stay true to myself and mm -hmm. to always make projects that mean something to me and not like get sucked up in any of the Hollywood hoopla. Well, congratulations. Your movie's about to go start, so you got to go okay. introduce it. Thank Very you nice so much. You. It was nice meeting Thank you also. You.